Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Collector's Corner. And today we're going to be taking a look at the Doom Collector's Edition for the PlayStation 4. You'll notice I've already slit this and actually look what happened up here. When I cut it, it peeled, it got stuck on my X-Acto, which is unfortunate. But that's okay, so let's just take a quick overview of the box here. Tells you what you get inside, of course, statues for the win, and shows some of the um, some of the art, not the art, screenshots. Anyways, let's open this bad boy up. As with almost all uh, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One um, collector's editions, you get this sort of overlay over the box itself. Mm. And they're usually a little bit of awkward to get out. So here we go. Here's the box. You can take two guesses what's inside this. So I don't know if there's any DLC, so we're going to open this up a little bit off camera. Okay, so okay, so cool. Here we go. So when you open up the box, you basically have uh, some warning saying that it could kill you. Uh, also very interesting is that it actually apparently lights up. There's LEDs and a rotating fan, which is kind of neat. I have no idea. Uh, if I have to unscrew stuff, I won't be able to do that on camera here, obviously, because I don't have any tools. So I'm going to turn this around and the game just slid right out. Okay. All right. <clears throat> So, basically, I didn't realize that the game was loose there. So the game's just like this. Dun 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 doom. So here you go. You get a nice steel uh, steel case, steel box, whatever you want to call it, um, for the game. Really, really nice. Okay, now I'm gonna open this off camera because yes so it comes with the season pass or no it doesn't or does it I don't know uh, okay hold on it's got a whole bunch of stuff here <laughs> so I know it's very exciting in the video you're you're looking at pretty much nothing uh, it's just no it's actually telling you about the season pass uh, do, 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 do. it comes with, see, so this is what it comes with. Here, let's look inside together. So you get this little, like, micro instruction manual. See, it says here, Season Pass 3 Multiplayer DLC Packs. But if I turn this around, it's simply telling you to purchase Dishonored 2. And this one says Demon Multiplayer Pack, okay. Um which is that it's uh, six hack modules three id logo patterns six metallic paints and this which is going off camera yeah if i turn this around this has the uh the dlc codes so that's it i'm not sure if this actually includes the um the season pass or not well you know what let's take a look what does it say on the box Let's see what it says here. Uh, -do -do -do. It comes with the full Doom game, exclusive steel book, um, metal case, and then you get this particular statue. So yeah, I guess it does not. It's funny that, eh? You purchase this thing for like 100 bucks, 120 bucks for the statue, and you don't even get the season pass. But I don't know, I can't confirm that until I put the game on and we'll see. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Oh, 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 oh. Hmm. We're opening it. It's alive! Wow, it's got one hell of a base, I'll tell you that. And there it is. Awesome. Oh, it includes batteries. That's always awesome. Batteries! Alright. So. He's a little fragile because he's skinny. Alright, let's 
put that there. Now I'm going to have to take the camera off and um, be able to be able to show you him a little bit better. So here he is. Look at this hell spawn. Whoa. It's naturally all made of plastic, but it looks really, really nice. Um, really like this base unit he's on as well. You can take a look there and see it looks absolutely awesome. It's going to look great on the shelf. Really, really, uh, really, really pleased with this. It's got a, a distinct odor to it, though. I think it, uh, it's it got like a paint smell to it. Um, see this little thing here this you can just remove here let me zoom in uh, really close I put batteries on they're on the underneath um, and if you turn it on I'm just gonna leave this off for right now you'll notice you get LEDs Ooh! and if I show you in there it says it's got a slow spinning turbine uh, I don't see that at all uh, I just see the lights I don't see the turbine inside <laughs> rotating at all you see here you should be able to see that it's not moving, so whatever, but uh, yeah, at night this would probably look really cool. You can see the LEDs and they're shining up at him a bit. Uh, that would look really, really excellent. Unfortunately, it's daytime here, so I got no real way of showing you guys, but um, very, very cool. I like the fact that it's just like a little switch to turn it on and off, and then you can just put this back. And that's it. There you go. Done. So very cool. Let's take a look at this guy. Let's go up close. Take a look at the bio, organic, and metal sick dude. <laughs> we go up and around. Really good. I love that face. Look at that face. Rah! Really nice with the, the weapons there. Just all around, very, very, very nice looking. I like the detailing in um, in this chest plate. Just really, really nice. Just all of it, actually. Look at the arm coming down. Very, very, very nice stuff. He looks like he's ready to attack. And that's that. All right, that's just a very quick look at uh, at the collector's edition of Doom. This is the PlayStation 4 version, but it's also available on the Xbox One and of course on PC. If you're interested in this particular version, I would suggest picking it up quick because it won't last long and this thing will be on eBay selling for a lot of money. Looks excellent. Can't wait to go put it on my shelf. Thanks for watching everybody and I'll catch you all in the next episode of Collector's Corner.